Hello everyone. Hey beauty connoisseurs. Happy New Year. I wish you all the best and the most prosperity and good health in the year 2022. So if you are new here, I would love for you to become a subscriber and click on the red button down below. Also click on the notification bell so that you will always know when I upload a new video. If you're interested in this wig that I'm wearing, it is a Bobby Boss unit. Her name is Milo, and I will leave the information card for it right up here. Now to move on to the wig that you saw in the thumbnail, please keep on watching. have today is Outre Sleek Lay Part Brizella and I'm sure you all have seen her all over these YouTube streets. She's very pretty and it's that new Sleek Lay that's supposed to lay really flat at the top and I have it in the DRFF Honey Brown. And this is the wig and the lace is already cut because I bought it from Still Looking Good 58. Um, I had this wig and this color on my wish list. And when I saw that she had it for sale on her website after she reviewed it, I thought, well, I might as well buy it from her because, I mean, it's the exact same thing I would have bought and just, you know, saved me a little money. And so I bought it from her. I think it was like $30 plus the shipping. And um, I knew that it was going to be uh, very nice. So um, there is the parting. And you can see my ring underneath there. Let me move it. And there's the two combs. And this is why you have the, uh, the sleek lay flat because the parting is the lace they give you a little more lace on each side so that the part is wider and um this black cap part is more spread out so that helps it to lay flatter and here's the comb in the back and the adjustable bands and it's the uh breathable cap so i'm gonna put this on um she didn't tint the lace, but she's a very fair-skinned lady, so she didn't have to. I'm going to use my um, wig knot healer so that the lace will blend in with my complexion, and I'll be back with the wig on. Brazella, the way I styled it and I used my hair fetish on the part and to blend the lace in um, right here along the hairline and didn't utilize any wispy hairs I didn't really see any wispy hairs and I don't remember if um, Faith cut the wispy hairs out but I've gotten to the Point where I don't really use the wispy hairs here lately I'm just so over them and um, yeah I like this style she kind of reminds me a little bit of uh, the little sister to Kamaya and this is how she looks it's a nice length I think it's about 16 to 18 inches and this is all the hair to the back And I love this color. Love, love, love. And I haven't gotten any shedding. I only see one uh, strand in the uh, brush, but it's already been reviewed. So if there was any shedding, 
maybe all of the shed, shedding hair has been released already. Um, it's a very light yakky texture and you have the highlights here framing the fray, framing the face. <laughs> And the curls go back like they should. They're obedient. They're not misbehaving and going all every which way that they want to go. And I love the density. And I think she's a little bit uh, thicker than Kamaya. And just a little bit more yakky. But very, very pretty. I love this. And I knew I was going to like it. And no matter what color you get her in, um, it's going to be beautiful, I think. So, um, the cap construction, I think it's big head friendly. Um, Outre is pretty good about that. The only um, wigs I have a problem with being uh, not big head friendly are Bobby Boss. So, and I think the one that I just took off, Milo. I don't remember if I mentioned it in that video, but she's not big head friendly at all. So, yeah. Um, I think that's about it for this review. So,